Recently, we have heard the cries of our poor Mayan brothers and sisters about the need to have BDF in their villages. The job of the government of Belize is to take care of its citizens. And as we speak, Guatemalans are encroaching not only in the village of Otasha, but also in the village of Dolores, Poite, San Vicente. And these villagers are crying out for help. So what I would like to see today, or see today, is to call upon the government of Belize to really give urgent attention to the villages down south. These people are getting encroached upon as we speak, they are clearing lands. And this is no ordinary Mayaman from across the border. These are big, rich guys from Guatemala City moving into our territory. What they do is they hire the Maya guys to try and clear the land. Once the land is civilized, then the big ranchers from Guatemala move in and occupy the land, which is inside Belize's territory. It has been several years now since the Prime Minister, in one of his Independence Day speech, promised to establish up to 12 outposts along the borderline. So far, none has been established in the Columbia Forest Reserve, which is in urgent need. And every so often, they try to shut the crowd up and say, oh, well, there's been money allocated for the Columbia. There has been no management presence in the Columbia Forest Reserve, which is really and truly a very important piece of our territory. In fact, all of our territory of Belize is very important, but especially this area where Guatemalans continue to encroach into the Columbia and extract our natural resources.